What's going on, folks? Day before Easter. How's everybody doing on this day before Easter, Saturday, springtime? Nice day. Still a little chill in the air, but oh no, real sunny, nice day. Um, man, Honey Baked Ham was packed up there on on Main Street in McNaughton. God bless. Hit the waiting line. Hit the wait. They were letting people one at a time in there. When one comes out, the other go in. Because, you know, mask up with the COVID. All that mess you got to do. That's what's happening, folks. Tomorrow we're not going to have a Sunset Sunday. We're taking the time off for that. Till next Sunday, be back on the 11th. Hey, you got to do what you got to do. So sometimes you got to lay back, refresh up. Um, it's still a little chilly out this far ago. But, um, you know, my, my, my point talking today is that <laughs> I got this guy called, you know, you know, I'm an internet marketer, online market, entrepreneur type, you know, digital entrepreneur, whatever names you want to use or call it. Um, what is this artificial intelligence? Something I got this thing from smart news. I get these smart news apps and stuff. You know, if you want to have something to talk about. Pay attention to news. Pay attention to stuff. Um, this this plenty of stuff to talk about. I hear people all the time about they ain't got nothing to say on um, on live and stuff. That's the dumbest. I mean, there's too much. There's too much going on. If you want to, if you want to move your business, you got to do lives. You got to put yourself out there. I've been saying this, but this guy contacted me on today. This happened today, and this happened so many times. And this is what I'm saying. This is the rudest thing you can do when you contact anybody you don't have a relationship with or anything. You know, he's uh, selling Forex. Got no problem with Forex. Trading. Got no problem with it at all. The problem I have with a lot of you guys, Forex, Bitcoin, and all this. When I tell you I ain't interested and then you continue to try to sell me, then we got a problem. It's like people... When you're talking on the phone with somebody, you're trying to get a word in and act like they're ignoring what you got to say. That's the same kind of situation, conversation I have with a lot of y'all online. That's rude as fuck. I will block you, cut you off, hang up on you, or whatever the hell I need to do. But don't come to me that way. See, the biggest problem is not the marketing, is your approach in marketing. A lot of y'all, all y'all care about is selling y'all stuff. What well, we all do, but it's not the stuff that you're trying to sell. Is the problem? Is your approach? Is the way you do it? And uh, I try to tell people, you don't have you don't have a relationship with somebody. Don't be coming straight out talking about. Well, I got this thing going. Da -da 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 -da. And what I try to do is help people. Try to help people. Say, it's, it's your approach how you selling people to people. It's the approach. It's how you doing it. People don't give a shit about your your product, my product, or whatever. They care about their own, and that's true. But when they're doing something wrong, like 98.9% of y'all online are, that's why a lot of y'all going to end up in Facebook jail. Y'all going to end up getting blocked. All that kind of, It doesn't matter which social media platform. People will block you. People will report you as a pest. People will do all kinds of stuff like that to you to block you, to get you off the so or get banned off social media, whatever the heck they'll do. It's the way you approach people that's the that that's going to determine whether people are going to respond to you or whatever. Okay? And it's, 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 that's the biggest problem. Hey, remember, this is called social media. Remember in one of my videos I said we're going into spring, summer? Or summer, spring, whatever you want to call it. Don't be that guy get blocked that people run away or don't get invited to the cookout. Do you remember me saying that? Well, a lot of y'all going to be that guy or that gal. Because all y'all going to do is always trying to get somebody to see your business. That's all y'all trying to do. You're going to get blocked from the cookout. Ooh, this a little windy out here. You're going to get blocked from the party this summer, from the pool parties, wherever you may be at. You want to be that guy or gal. Okay, that's what you're going to have to understand. Ain't nobody going to sit up there and, and, and want to be bothered with you. 
there's ways to approach people online, okay? And it's the, I guess you could call it business etiquette or whatever. Wow, look at this. Amazon trucks all over the place. We got an Amazon fulfillment center on Nelson Road, and they're all over the place. Here it comes down the road. Here. More and more of those are around here today. So, it's just about how you do things, people. You got to learn to do things in a, a manner that doesn't turn people off. But then you got to learn, sometimes some people you need to turn off. Because they know who you're talking about. All right? You got to learn to do things in a manner in which you attract and don't repel. And don't be chasing. And people don't like to be chased. Even, even women don't like to be chased all the damn time. Okay? You, you know, in, in a relationship, it is better. You have the upper hand when you attract, folks. And that's in any type of relationship. I've always said that. Then we're going to talk, have a, you know, I'm going to be announcing some few things that we're going to have near the end of the month. Now, maybe hope that will help some of y'all in your marketing. Uh, it's, it's, it's going to be like the challenge. It's going to be a, this is a three days. It's going to be on a weekend that runs into my sunset Sunday. But you'll hear more about this. Um, and we're going, we, we're here to help. Now, you know, we're here to help. See if anybody would be interested in doing this. This is going to be a free event for this three days. Free. Okay? I thought about charging something, but I said, you know what? We'll talk about that later. Okay? But this is to get you understanding what you're doing wrong, why you're doing it wrong. The people who are telling you one thing and don't know that they're doing it wrong. And that they're hurting their own business, they're hurting their own network, they're hurting their own team by the way they train most marketers, network, especially in the network marketing home business base, the wrong way to do it. Everybody that you confront, I don't care what's on their profile, I don't care what the profile says, I don't care if they say entrepreneur, they're in the same niche, all that kind of stuff. You need to find out one thing, and we'll be talking about this, and how... You need to find out about whoever you think you should prospect. Because everybody ain't your prospect, folks. Okay? And listen to who you're talking to. Don't be ignoring when somebody says they're not interested or this and that. You come back with a question, okay, well, how can I help you with something if there's anything you can help them with? Too many of y'all just want to sell that product. You ignore the question. And that's the most rudest thing that you can do with anybody. That's the same thing as some people do when they talk to you on the phone. They don't let you get, they don't even acknowledge what you said. So when you do that on social media, that's the same rudeness that I see a lot of people do on the phone. They do it on people on social media. And nobody wants to be bothered, especially me, because I'll block you, hang up on you in a minute. I don't care. Understand something. I don't need all y'all. Okay? All, I don't I don't even chase people and people come to me with stuff. All right. Because I believe I got the cookie to help people. It's not arrogance, it's just this, because I see a lot of y'all doing this shit wrong. So if you want help, you don't have to come to me. Okay? It's just like if you want um if you're thirsty and there's a well, you want water, the water ain't gonna splash up to you, you're gonna have to go to the water. So that's just the attitude I got about all this whole thing. With that being said, it's a bit chilly out here. Everybody have a great rest of their weekend. We're going to be heading up in the 70s next week. Thank God, because I want to get some of this chill off the air. All right? Peace, people. Take care. Don't eat too much. Be safe. And we'll see you on the next video. I'm out. Later.